News at 11. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Rob Macko. A pilot was flying south from Morgantown when his flight was cut short over Crown City, Ohio. As 13 News reporter Lane Ball tells us, he landed safely in a farmer's cornfield, but the investigation into what caused this incident continues. This emergency landing happened just after two Monday afternoon. We noticed at about around four o'clock today, um, he was already on the ground and the State Highway Patrol and the Sheriff was coming out here. We were able to find out that this plane is a 2007 Beechcraft Bonanza. And when we looked up this number right here, we found out the owner is Doug Reynolds of Huntington, West Virginia. According to Flight Aware, a software tracking program, the plane took off from Morgantown Airport just after 1 p.m. and reported the emergency landing around 2.08 p.m. The pilot was able to land the aircraft safely in this cornfield off of Ohio State Route 7 in Crown City. No one was hurt and the landowner Jason Butler says it will not affect their normal farm work. But this isn't the first plane that's landed in their field. This is actually the third time that there's been a plane actually in this field. There was a case a few years ago where a guy's engine blew up and they actually fixed the plane here and, and actually took it off from right here too. As for this case, the plane was still in the field as of Monday night. The Ohio State Highway Patrol has not released information on what caused the emergency landing. The Federal Aviation Administration will also be investigating the cause and is expected to examine the plane on Tuesday. But Butler says there's still no word yet on when the aircraft will be off his property. Well, they haven't told us when they're going to remove it or, or what's going on just yet, but hopefully we can find out something in the next few days. Reporting in Crown City, Lane Ball, 13 News.